Now, as you already know, it is World Kombucha Day, but now we're adding a little spice to the mix and making Kombucha Day cocktails. <laughs> and we're bringing in the experts, the official Booch tender from Booch Craft, Kylie. Kylie, thank you so much for being here. Thank you guys so much. We're so happy to be here as well. Yes, happy kombucha day to both of you. Thank you. So you happy kombucha day to you. <laughs> thank you so much. I'm a new kombucha drinker, so thank you so much. <laughs> Good. What do you guys like <laughs> Love most? It. What do you like most about kombucha? I think that there's always this, especially with Boochcraft, there's this freshness to to the drink that, you know, when you're drinking it, it's it's just easy to drink and easy to to enjoy. I when Talking about kombucha in general, I mean, outside of the the hard kombucha space, which we're in, there's so many benefits to drinking it, whether it's, you know, immunity boosting or gut health. Um, but at the end of the day, just I think it just tastes really great. Um, and that's really what we lean into at Boochcraft is making a really fresh tasting hard kombucha that lets you enjoy your kombucha, but just with a little extra spice. <laughs> 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 I love that. So you guys, uh, yeah, you're th like the booch tenders instead of bartenders. I love the play on worlds, but how much alcohol is going to be in this drink? <laughs> so um, the, the drink is going to include one shot of tequila. Plus it's going to have be topped with a, our grapefruit hibiscus boochcraft hard kombucha, which is 7% ABV. So it does pack a punch, but we find that uh, starting if you're new to if you're new to hard kombucha or you're new to kombucha, adding it into a mixed drink really gives it um, a little more familiarity for you to you know start to introduce yourself to this type of beverage. Although we do find that the hard kombuchas tend to be a little bit easier to drink um, when it comes to someone that might be a little sensitive to that more vinegary taste. Okay, I like that. Okay, so let's make this yeah. drink. Let, let let me see what you guys got. Cool. <laughs> Awesome. Well, Kylie is going to be making the drink. Um, I am going to be walking you guys through everything that she is doing. Perfect. Um, so we call this drink the spicy hibiscus fizz. Um, so we're really starting by rinning the glass. Uh, so we have a little bit of agave on the plate and a little bit of tahini, uh, just to give some spice around the rim. So that's completely optional. You can either add it to one side, add it to the full rim. But at the end of the day, it adds a little fun garnish and a little extra flavor when you take your first sip. So next, we're going to drop some ice into a cocktail shaker um, and add, to, add we're going to add two jalapenos. So we pre-slice these before coming on and a little bit of agave syrup, just 0.5 ounces of agave. Uh, this is going to help break down the jalapenos. So you get that fresh spiciness and it really pulls through the flavor. Uh, so just have, adding that little bit of agave really gives a hit when you finally do get to drink the cocktail. So we'll dump that straight into kind of the, the larger cocktail shaker. And we're going to add just a touch of fresh grapefruit juice. Um, in Boochcraft, we use real fresh fruit that we juice in-house. So we find using fresh grapefruit juice in our cocktails makes it just stand out a little bit more and gives it that extra, extra hit. Next, we're going to add 1.5 ounces of tequila. Uh, we use a clear tequila. Uh, we generally ask people to lean into our an organic uh, tequila just to keep the full drink organic since Boochcraft is a 100% USDA certified organic drink. And then we're going to shake the fun part. So uh, <laughs> Kylie actually taught me Kylie taught me something. So you know you're done shaking when the outside of the container gets cold. So your hand will actually get cold and you'll be you'll know it's ready to pour. So next up we're just going to drop that, that right into the glass. It's Already looking delicious, a super simple pour. We don't strain it because we want that fresh jalapeno to go inside the glass. Ooh, We're gonna okay. top with ice and leave and leave plenty of room to give a good hit of our grapefruit hibiscus boochcraft on top. I love that. You girls are doing the thing. <laughs> Thank yes. you so much for being so there here. There you, you have it. Yes, thank you for teaching us how to make that. Uh, guys at home, we got to make some, some alcoholic kombucha. <laughs> okay.